Right, in this video I'm going to show you how to bridge your connection from Windows to your yeah, Xbox 360. Alright, I'm on a Mac. You can do it on the Mac too, it's a little harder, but it works better on Windows. <clears throat> you get moderate on X on a Windows, I mean on Mac, so just do it on Windows. Alright, so go to Control Panel. Go to Network and Sharing Center. Then go to changing change adapter settings all right mine is connected already so i'm gonna delete this delete okay this is how yours is gonna be so you're gonna have the bluetooth um ethernet cable connection and wireless connection all right so you highlight your wireless and ethernet and it has to be connected to your xbox and your Xbox has to be on. You don't have to be signed in. See, I'm not signed in. All right, so you highlight them, and you click on it, and bridge connections. That's all you have to do. So it's working, working, working. That popped up, and it's doing it. Just leave it alone. Wait till it says, see it has an X. Wait till the X goes away, which it just did. It's identifying. All right, it keeps going. It's take like a minute. So, hurry up. My phone is about to die. <laughs> uh, hurry up. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, man. Enable bridge connection. Come on, just work, bastard. Oh, I think that was the problem. I'm not connected. Yeah, I am. What the hell? Connect, bastard. Alright, so. Fuck, man. Oh, I almost deleted it. Well, it did it. See, it takes a while. It messed up, but it still does it by itself, so. Whew, almost messed up my video. Alright. So it's connected to Linsky. Make sure it says your network name right there. See, so it says Linsky, that's mine. Alright, so we're gonna go to my Xbox, which I have this remote. You're gonna wanna sign in. Should work. Perfect. Just like signing in to any other thing. Do, do, do. Taking forever. Alright, signed in. I have 10 friends on. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, yeah, have friends on. Now we're gonna press the middle button. Go all the way to the right. Go to system settings. And we're gonna go to network settings. And then configure network. All right, so this is what you're gonna need. You're gonna need, the, you're gonna see this. You're gonna need your IP address and your gateway code. So. That's the second one and the fourth one. You go all the way on this side and tells you you need the second one, which is right there. It's mine. I don't know why it keeps on changing, but whatever. And this one. That one. So the second and fourth one you need. So just take those, copy them down. You're going to need them later. All right. So back over to this. Oh, now that's done you don't really need to do that if you're just bridging your connection but if you want to have a open that then you do this this is to open your net so you open up internet explorer I don't want you to see my home page so you're gonna type in your type in your what is it gateway right so this is my gateway, 6 eight. Yours is probably going to be the same. It might be different. Just like how you got it from your Xbox, you guys just got to put it in the same way. It might be exactly the same. All right, now this page is going to pop up if you have Linsky. This is what I have. This is my connection. It's my router. All right, so. It might show up that you need to put in a password, username and password. It's going to be admin, and the password is going to be admin. they both admin. Or it might be different. If it's different, just comment me or send me a message. I'll help you out. Subscribe, whatever, you know. All right, so here we're going to go. We're going to go to administration. All right. So from here, I'm going to scroll down. 
All right, the UPNP. You need to enable it. Sometimes it's disabled. Like right here, this sometimes it's disabled. Just click enable and save settings. All right. And this screen pops up. Just press continue. All right. So that's done. Now we go with this. All right. This is what you need to listen to or look at. Pause the video if you want to copy exactly this. You need to copy exactly what I have. Every single thing has to be exactly the same. Except for this. This is where your IP address comes in that I told you to copy down from your Xbox. So type, the only thing you could change is the last three numbers. You might have one number, just put the one number in if you have it. Like it might be a one or a two. Or it might be like that. Mine's was five. I mean, mine's was. 105 so before and it keeps on changing I think it's because I bridge my connection but it works perfect doesn't matter just type it in and then you gotta enable all of them those three you have to enable and put those codes in exactly the same how I have them exactly the same everything exactly the same <laughs> and then you go down you're gonna set, scroll down here and save settings right there then this thing's gonna pop up again all right continue all right and that's that's it you fixed it you have an open that all right so now we're gonna go back to the xbox with my red controller all right so still at the configure network press b to back out test your connection all right yes sign out whatever all right now it's testing your connection so Test, test, test. It's gonna take forever, even though my iPhone's dying. <sighs> all right, this went pretty fast. All right, so, all right, connect to Xbox Live. It's perfect. All right, now I'm gonna go. I'm gonna sign in. Cause it signed you out. So sign back in. Signing in. It should sign in. Perfect. Everything's good now. See, now I have 12 friends on. Alright, now I'm going to play Halo to show you that my NAT is open. Now, when I used to play Halo, I used to go to matchmaking, and it used to say, your NAT is not open, so you might have a problem connecting to people. Well, guess what? Because I did that when I bridged my connection and opened up my NAT, it works now. So, alright, hurry up, Halo, start. Alright, so we're going to go down to matchmaking. All right, good. Start matchmaking. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Usually, when you have a messed up NAT, down here it's gonna say your connection is not an open NAT. Go to Benji.net. I mean Benji. Bungie.net to fix it or whatever. You don't need to do that. You don't need to do that. All right. So it's connecting. It's players. Yep, see? Thanks to all the players, players found. It's working perfect. Do this to get your open at. It helps. Do it. Clarky. Gambit, you need to do it too. Hi, <laughs> people. Alright. Look at this idiot talking. <laughs> Alright, so. 